All right, so now that we have our building editor set up in Unreal, the next thing we're gonna do is allow our building generator to be driven by an external shape. The reason we wanna do that is because we wanna be able to model out floor shapes in Unreal Engine and have the building generator create on top of it. The first thing we'll do is prototype it in Blender. So here, what we're gonna do is add a new input node, just hit the plus sign. We're gonna call this building shape and we're going to switch the type to object basically what this allows us to do is select an external object and grab some data or information out of it let's go ahead and create the external object we will call it building shape as well and uh, let's add an underscore just a Oh, interesting. It actually names it. That's fine. All right, so now we'll select this and take the building shape. We're going to get the object ID. So, oops, object info. Plug the building shape there. And then from here, we can grab the data out of it. So, this is, you know, local rotation, local scale. Uh, local transforms. What we really want to do is grab the shape of the geometry. So that's essentially instead of grabbing it from the shape of the object we attach the geometry nodes to, we're going to take it from an external object. Okay. Now we can go ahead and set this to that building shape. Dot one zero oh one. So notice we have a building shape here already. That's because um, this is the second time I'm recording this tutorial. So, all right. And what you'll see here is if you scale this building shape, well, that's a little bit odd. Oh, uh, here it is, building shape. Right, nothing will happen, right? Um, that's because what you're editing here is actually the scale data and not the geometry data. What you want to adjust is the geometry data. So. If we switch to edit mode and scale, now you'll see that the building shape is changing. Okay. I'm just going to hide the modules here real quick. And from here, we can start kind of laying out the city. Okay. And we can adjust the building sizes. I just selected an edge and then extruded it. And then we can select another edge and also extrude it. Okay. We can take a corner and bevel it. Then we can take another building and So as you can see here, we have a lot of different options as far as how we're laying out our little city block here. Now remember, the goal here is to do this in Unreal Engine. So in the next tutorial, we're going to take these same shapes, but instead of building them in Blender, we're going to be building them in Unreal. And this way we can get some dynamic feedback, right, and easy to iterate and play our game to see if the, the layout is working.